I'm Kosuke91 here. And today, guys, I'm going to be starting a new series for you guys. And you guys may have, I'm sure you probably have actually seen it before on YouTube. Um, Lamb Chops does it. Or no, yeah. Well, Lamb Chops does do it, but uh, I believe Tactics was the one who came up with it. And it is a series called uh, Hunt for Conrad David. He opens bronze packs in search of a Conrad David. And basically, I guess he's in like open packs until hopefully he will pull a Conrad David. And I want to do the same idea, and since it's like, you know, not very expensive just to open bronze packs, and it's actually fun, like, you know, pulling different bronze players and stuff. And, um, yeah. So I'm going to be starting that series, guys, on my channel. And so, yeah, I don't want you guys to be thinking I'm stealing the idea, stealing the idea from him. Um, like, well, basically I am, but I'm I just, you know, I'm going to be doing the same idea of a series. Um, and I'm giving him credit, so yeah. And we're gonna start the series here. Um, I just want to show you guys how much he's going for. He's going for a ridiculous amount. He's going for the cheapest one up is 63k. By now, that is a lot of pucks. On um, there's only three up, and this card looks insane. It's boosted. It's not even fully boosted either. He has 14 dreams on. Huh? Alright, so I only have two K as you guys can see in the top right corner. Um so sadly, you know, it's hard to like pull good stuff and only, you know, six hundred uh bronze packs, six hundred puck bronze packs, but that's all I'm gonna be opening for the first episode. Um you know, I'll open, you know, some bronze jumbos for the next one. Uh, but just to get the series started, I'm just going to open some of these. So, uh, let's just get right into it. Let's open back here. Henrik Sedin. Let's see what you can bring with it. Oh. Four players. Let's see what we got here. We have Bruce. We have Olsen. We have all these different players. I'm not going to try to pronounce the other ones. Um... Plus two all. I always keep these. Just because honestly, we probably made our pucks back from this pack too. By the way, you guys, bronze packs are a great way to make pucks if you want to make some pucks. Um, as usually, whenever you open them, you always make, you know, your pucks back for the most part. And, um, yeah. Let's see how it goes. Carry Price, there we go. Hopefully, we could at least get a rare bronze player in these. That's what's terrible about these, you can't really pull anything good, so yeah. Might not be the most exciting first episode, but, you know, like I said, we'll open the uh, bronze jumbos for the next one, or even maybe some bronze minis if I do uh, some national collection or something. Uh, I'm just, just got out of the packs there. Maybe he'll refresh our luck, give us a rare bronzer. Let's go, Johnny T. What can you bring us? And we don't even get the rear Uh, this guy, he looked pretty good. <laughs> Goes for 50 pucks, I guess. Um, yeah. Nothing too great so far, guys. No. Not even any rear bronzes, but that's okay. Alright, so we have enough for it, looks like. Probably one more. Let's see what Gary Bryce give us here. Let's go. And we don't even get a rare bronze again. Oh, we get this guy. Look at that face. Very nice. Um. Whoa. Now, I'm guessing that this. Let's see. It says, uh. And this guy might actually go for something, but um, I'm assuming that's just from a wager. I don't think he's actually gonna go for it much, but just in case, I'm gonna uh, send him my trade pal there. Um, so I guess this concludes for our first episode of Hunt for Comrade David. Um, I'm sorry it wasn't like the most exciting episode. Um, but yeah, guys, thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button.